With the email marketing in All Pro Web Tools, it's possible to create an email campaign to automatically send a list of specific emails to a customer over a specified period of time. To do this, you will need the email marketing web tool, which you can add by going to Settings and then Web Tools. Then go to the Available Web Tools button and scroll down until you find email marketing. And you can click Add. And now you have the email marketing tool installed. Before you create an email campaign, you will first need to create the emails that will be sent out as part of that campaign. To do that, on the left menu, go to Emails and click on View Emails. If you have not already created the emails you will be using in your campaign, you can click on the Create New Email button to create each email that you will be sending out. Once you have created them, go to Emails and click on Manage Campaigns. At the top of this page, this is where you will create new email campaigns. At the bottom of the page, it shows a list of all the existing campaigns that have already been created. To create a new campaign, you will first need to name it. This is a name that only you will see. The second option tag is used to automatically tag customers who are put in this email campaign. So for instance, I can go over here and select garden group as a tag. And now every customer that gets put into this coupon emails campaign will automatically be tagged as a garden group. The next piece, trigger, is used to determine how customers are entered into this email campaign. For instance, if I click on the drop down menu, I can see that one of my triggers is a product purchase. So I can set this campaign to automatically start sending emails to someone if they bought a specific product. Likewise, there's an option for category purchase. So I can start this campaign in sending emails to any customers who buys any product in a specific category. Another option, fill out sign up box, can be used to link this campaign to a specific sign up box so that when users finish filling it out, not only is their contact information put in your CRM, it will automatically get this email campaign as well. Manual can be used if you want to manually put people in this campaign from their CRM record. Once you have finished setting all the options for your new email campaign, go ahead and click Save. Now that you have created the campaign, you'll need to go down and find it in the list. Here's the campaign I just created. So I will go over and click on Edit Emails. Currently, there are no emails in this campaign. So I'll first select an email from a dropdown of all the emails that I've created. Next, I will have to select how long I want the system to wait before sending the second email and then you can click on Add Email. Now I'm going to add a second email to this campaign using the same process that we did before. And lastly, I will send a third email. So for this campaign, users will first be sent the save $5 email, then seven days later, be sent the save $10 email, then another 14 days later, be sent the $15 email. After that, I do not have a fourth email selected, so users will stop receiving emails from this campaign. Note that the campaign chooses when to send out emails based on when the customer first signed up for the campaign. So if you would like your customers to get an email on a specific date, for that you should use the schedule email under emails and view emails.